Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys. Wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel on this beautiful Saturday morning. A short TA update on Bitcoin and five amazing charts that will help you this weekend with understanding a little bit more about the movements of Bitcoin. Let's quickly jump into the charts because I want to keep it short. It's Saturday. I need to zoom in a little bit more at life. Let's bam. Oh. No, we are opening with my tweet. Always remember to zoom out on Bitcoin and zoom in at life. Don't stress about every single Bitcoin minute candle, but zoom in at life and try to enjoy every single minute of the day. That is how we start and bam, there is where we go. <clears throat> Today, not starting with a four hour chart, but we are starting with a day chart. Just to show you what is happening. We have this huge red trend line coming down. We found support on that one. We broke it over here. And now we found support on that one. The important thing that I'm watching now, you can see the VPFER, the anxiety, the volume, is this yellow line. This is the 21 moving average. Okay? Very important on the weekly chart. So you can see this is on the weekly chart. So that's a different time frame. But that one for me is important. If we close a candle down below that level, then it gets really exciting because then I think we can drop all the way here to 39 and maybe even lower here to 37 um, before we find support again. A very important line, if we look back in history, you can see this every time that we break that one with a day candle on the weekly. Here you get the huge drop that was the, the, the of course, the, the dump of in March. But look, if we break it, we come down and we find that line again as a <clears throat> resistance till we break it again to the upside very important line as far as you look back here 2017 when we broke it we came above it a little bit but then it became resistance so in my opinion the weekly 21 moving average is an important line to keep an eye on and that is what we are doing and um, the green lines are the lines of support you can see they are in line with the volume over here this gap and um, that is the support area we need to find support here and um, till now I'm not freaking out. This was the low, for example. This was the low, for example. This is a higher low. So we are still creating higher lows. It's not like a huge, beautiful higher low, but the highs are also still a little bit higher. So the thing that we need to do now is create a higher high. And then we are can talk again a little bit more about an uptrend. Oh, that's many lines instead of this huge downtrend. But that will take some time, guys. That's why I said, don't freak out on every minute chart. Let's jump into BAM over here. Because I got some questions about members on YouTube. Did he, did the BAM indicator tell you that this drop was coming? We are now on the one hour chart without the BAM. I'm going to put on the BAM over here. Let's see. The one hour chart. We had a short flag over there. That was at two o'clock. We had a red candle closing down below the yellow stepping line over there. We had the bam bam crossing over there. We had the red line on top, a red dot, the yellow starting over here. And from this moment, we became completely yellow and that was over there. So yes, the bam bam called that short. And if you would have taken that short at the moment here, you would have stepped out at the long flag, for example, that would be a 6% uh, profit. So yes, the BAM BAM is uh, working over there. Really cool that the BAM BAM is doing that. Let's quickly jump into these other charts over here. These ones, BAM, keep it short. Um, that's difficult for me to keep it short because I always keep talking. Look, this is really cool. Uh, China banned Bitcoin again. <laughs> yeah, Every time when China bans Bitcoin, you can see the move. Um, on the 12th um, May in 2013, uh, China banned Bitcoin. And since that moment, we moved of 3,600%. At that moment, the Bitcoin price was $1,000. But in that year, Bitcoin moved 60%. And here again, in 2017, Bitcoin was 4,000. China banned Bitcoin. The move till now 900, but that year 80%. 
here again 2018 two times china banned bitcoin two times the move was like 60 and 80 percent in 2019 china banned bitcoin again the move after that was 150 percent now in may china banned bitcoin the move till now was 50 percent guys so every time china bans we see a huge move maybe there's a correlation but it's very funny to point out bam over here something else that is very funny is of course this one um this is the bitcoin balance on the exchanges we are seeing a bitcoin balance on exchanges over here that is very low we haven't seen that low bitcoin balance since this moment i'm there that's like 2018 that's three years ago so this is beautiful in my opinion because when the balance disappears from exchanges it goes into hardware wallets into cold storage into Will's hands that keep the bitcoins for the long term and don't freak out in a minute. You can see that over here as well. Um, yes, you can see that. You can see that um, all the exchanges experience the same. You can see that they all lose bitcoin balance. So all the exchanges people are taking down their bitcoins i think that's very beautiful um and are those people in profit bam that is what we see in this chart yes those people are in profit as you can see over here this is the percentage of profit uh, the, the percentage of the supply and profit that's how i need to say it and um, at the moment we are here at 78 percent 78 percent from the supply is in profit sorry for the airplane uh, i'm in lisbon a lot of planes flying over 78% and we have been creating and um, if you see this low over here higher higher high higher every time when this um, supply and profit reaches this pink box over there that's also when we top out in the market check over here that's the top of the market over here the top of the market so when the percentage of profit comes into this box again between 95 and 100 percent you know that you need to take profit because more most people will do we have any other chart yes bam over here we have beautiful charts here we can see the bitcoin price history lock scale diminishing returns per halving so we can see and um, from the first halving we went all the way up to 50 dollar the second we went all the way up to 2000 so 2200 2000 the second to the third we went from 400 to 4000 to yeah you know all know that to 20000 and now um we need to do like this is times 40 sorry times 20 times 10 diminishing so that will mean 400 times 10 is 4000 4000 is times times 40000 so we are now here exactly in the mid we need to top out somewhere over here which would be between 100 and 300,000 US dollar in my opinion but <coughs> who am I? Bam! Over here I think my face was exactly somewhere in the channel ah, it was good, it was good DD, don't worry it was good and um, here it is not good so here I need to put my face in the top over there and um, here you can see the same but now exact prices the $31, the 1250 the 25000 so we went to 20 so if you now look at the chart we would be now in this area um, then you would see that there has been a peak above that area in every halving cycle and every four years we are still very low here we had a peak here we had a peak here we had a peak yes the peaks became lower lower and that peak can become even lower as well hit 150 but we still need to see that peak that was everything for today guys bam i hope you really enjoyed the short ta update if you did enjoy it then please give the video a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification and please leave a comment also when you want to trade with the bam bam indicator go to the bitcoinfamily.com and if you want to use all the trading platforms that i trade on then please use the referral links down below the videos Femix has a huge bonus prime xp has a huge bonus um, i think bybit has a huge massive bonus at the moment binance doesn't have a bonus but it's a very good exchange to spot trade thanks for watching i wish you an amazing saturday maybe i will do the dutch live today again it's a long time ago so i think i will do one um, and i wish you a beautiful saturday see you tomorrow again bam